Aloha everyone, today I'm going to teach you how to install Macintosh Snow Leopard in a notebook, um, netbook. Um, today I will use um, Dell Mini 9 to do it as an example. So um, let's do it, okay? First you need to know um, how to get the netbook bookmaker. Um, you can go to my website www.alohaeveryone dot com um, find out my post and then download from there I should post a link over there okay and the second of all you need to get a uh, hold of the snow leopard uh, this image um, actually you can use it uh, use the original retail disk as well but um, today I'm going to use the disk image to uh, do the demo okay let's um, mount the image to the system first um, in order to do this, you need to get um, can hands on a um, Macintosh. It will be much easier. So uh, after you open this image on a Macintosh, and then you would like to bring up the disk utilities. Um, you can go to application folder, go utilities. So after you mount the image, um, it will have the Mac OS X installation DVD here. Um, if you are using original um, disk in a CD drive or DVD drive, you will see this kind of icon here as well. So let me go this way. Now um, you need to have a eight gigabyte or about. USB drive to um, create the installation tools. Um, for now, I'm going to plug in a 8 gig USB on it. The system should detect it in a moment. Okay, I have a um, gigabyte uh, USB drive here. And what you need to do is select it, and then I will choose. Partition. Select one partition. Put the name on it. Um, you can do whatever you want. I will type net book. Netbook install. Select uh, Mac OS extended partition format. Go to option here and then select GUID partition table. Click OK. So and then you can partition it. Alright, um it will start formatting your USB drive and then it took a couple seconds. Okay, so you can see Netbook installer here is new to later. Okay, now you should highlight this and then click restore. What you need to do is drag the installation disk image to the source and then drag your installer partition here. Since this partition is newly formatted, so um, you don't have to erase the uh, destination again. Now, click restore, and then it will start uh, create uh, put all the installation file to the USB drive. As I say, um, when I click on the restore button, it will ask me username, password, and I will skip it. Okay, I will skip and sh not showing to you guys. Stay tuned. It, this process will take around um, 20 minutes up to 2 hours depends on how fast is your USB drive ok now click restore once the um, restore complete it will go back to full screen and you can change
check by double click the netbook installer here to make sure everything is here now this enter to the second stage which is make the installer to become a bootable drive for your mini 9 okay close the this utility then we need to use the netbook boot maker double click unzip it and then you, you have the file you have the program here double click again click open and then it will ask you select USB partition which is your netbook installer and click on the prepare boot drive it will take around two minutes okay let's get it start and once it's done I'm going to take you to the stage 3 which is install the macOS 